I want to talk about some of the nitty-gritty um, aspects of music notation, some of the really um, gory details. I'm going to start with tie basics. In general, single notes are tied opposite the stem direction, and the arc of a tie falls within the interval of a third, and I've shown that right here. You'll see that the arc of the tie, it points to the center of the note and arcs from the C space through the E space, and that's what I mean by the interval of a third. For single notes with short ties, the ends of the tie point to the center of the note head, and I'll talk about some exceptions to that later, but in general, a single note tied is going to... Uh, the tie is going to point to the center of the note head and avoid staff lines at the center of the arc, uh, such as this. Now, ties will cross a staff line if the note is on a line or if the tie is a long one. So here you see the tie crosses a line, so that's okay. A short tie, though, as we'll see later, will fall within a space. For example, here, and place the articulation outside of the tie. Here, the tie points from the center of the note to the center of the note it's tied to, and uh, it falls within a space. It's a simple single note tie. Now, ties on simple chords fall within spaces if possible, unless the tie is a long one. So here, you see all the ties, two up and two down, they all fall within a space because this is a simple chord. In simple situations, all ties are the same length. <clears throat> now, a tie may touch a staff line tangentially, but should not lie directly on it. So here, the tie comes very close to the line, almost touching it. That's what I mean by tangentially. So the, the staff line is a tangent to the arc of the tie. Same thing in this situation. It's very close, but the tie is in the space, just touching the staff line. And here is, uh, again, the simple one-note tie with the uh, articulation outside of the tie. Uh, this would not be a staccato. Now, if it's a staccato situation, then it's, it's going to be a bowing indication, and that would not constitute a tie in this sense. Uh, the group of ties forms a column between simple tied chords. So here you've got all these ties are lined up, and if you can draw a straight line down and see where they are, so here, that's what I want to show. You have, you can draw a straight line. Uh, so that's what I mean by it forms a column.